YouTube. This is your boy Barber Stay Strap. Come with you today with another video about a gun that I've done a review before. It's on a Glock 22 Gen 3. I'm coming to you with this because I got this Glock to go in this MCK kit. This MCK kit is an amazing kit, man. It, it turns your gun into a PCC sub gun, you know, um, whatever you call it. And um, it's amazing to me, man. I've, I've always wanted one, but I didn't want to go out and buy a brand new gun, get an MCK kit. I'm looking at eight, nine hundred dollars. You know, I might as well buy, you know what I'm saying? Um, any kind of other PCC rather than, you know, doing what I've done. But me getting this Glock. For a buck fifty, man, I couldn't beat it. Cause at one time I was thinking about, well, I'm a, you know, I'm gonna beat the eyes. I'm gonna get a MCK kid and and probably get a um a Taurus G2C or G3C for like two hundred dollars. And then I come across this Glock for a buck fifty, man. I was like, man, I can't beat it. This is my chance to get me an MCK kid. So I did that. So I'm gonna show you mine today. Here it is, my MCK kit. Foldable brace, I love that. Uh, mine, mine came with pretty much the whole nine. It came with the sling. The pop-up sights on this thing. Um, nice little red dot that I put on there. And then cost that much, a little budget red dot that everybody has on their gun. Um, put a laser on here, put a little red laser on there, and mine already comes with the light. I had to have that light. I wanted to have the factory light. A lot of people said, um, it's supposed to be 500 lumens. A lot of people say it's not. I'm saying like, hey, it lights good up and good enough for me. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> But, um, yeah, man. I, um, for my personal defense, I, I run hollow points in there. For my personal defense, I run my hollow, hollow points. Um, when I'm going to the range, I use these FMJs right here. These, uh, ETS magazine holds 24. I got like 23 in there. Strictly for the range. I mean, I, I ordered, um, I ordered, ordered these magazines, they stay at competition. So I'm thinking like competition is supposed to be, you know, um, can handle anything. And after I had already ordered them, it didn't dawn on me that competition is just competition. Um, it will not run my hollows at all. It'll shoot one round and won't shoot the rest. So I'm, I'm good with that. I got I got enough um, Glock mags to, to be good in a self-defense situation. Um, I'm also thinking about buying the 22 round Glock factory mags just because the capacity is about the same as, as these right here, but official Glock. So I know they're going to run my hollows, but yeah, back to the, back to the kit. It's a great kit. Um, I already showed you the red dot that I got on there. I already done showed you, um, my sights and my sights are bought from MCK CAA. So CAA MCK. This red dot, this red dot, I got that off Amazon. It's not a high quality um, red dot, but it does the job. I see a lot of YouTubers running this same red dot, and they always say the same thing. Um, um, I'm not keeping it on there. I'm gonna get a better red dot later on. But why? Why do you have it on that period? You have it on that period because it really works. Don't I mean? There's no sense of saying, "Oh, I'm gonna get one better later on." No, you're not. You getting that red dot and you are gonna stick with it. I'm sticking with it because I don't have a lot of money in this kit and this gun. I'm not putting a $400 red dot on it. I'm not doing it. I'm keeping it. That's the way it is. But anyway, I'm rambling. Um, I want it the glass breaker i wanted the glass breaker it looked like it makes it look more more official a little more 
rough, a little bit more gangster. I like that. <clears throat> um, let's see. Turn that thing around there. I got I got the little grips that I had to put them on myself. It kind of matches the stippling that I have on my gun. I had to have that. And the most important part about this gun that I really love the most, I love this thumb rest. It feels so comfortable. It's like the way you supposed to hold that gun. I mean, you're already getting four points of contact, but look. This is the weird thing molds in your hand, man. Like that. This is the way you're supposed to rock that gun like that. With your thumb resting on there. I mean, a lot of people put their own light. I didn't want my own light. I wanted they light because I like the way it sits. And I like this thumb rest. I got to have this thumb rest. If you got if you got this kit, you must have that thumb rest. I mean, when you get that thumb rest and you put your thumb on there, it's like it's meant to be on there. But yeah, man. This is your ultimate backpack gun, truck gun, whatever. And I have it in 40 cal, so that you know it gives it a little bit more um, punch. Not too much more punch, but a little bit more punch. But yeah, man, I whip I whip this out, man, and I can I can go to work, and I got the reliability of having a Glock. Man, you can't beat it. I think I made the right decision rather than getting a Taurus, not not down in people that got Tauruses, but a Glock is what I initially wanted, and it came it came to fruition for me. So you know I'm I'm good on that. And it's it's so it's so small. I have a little small bag. Well, I had a small bag. It fell on the floor. But anyway, <laughs> nice, nice little bag. It comes in. And like I said, I fold that thing up. It should be ready to rock. And it, and it does shoot without the, um, without this being all the way extended. I can fold that and just still be able to shoot. But yeah, man. Nice gun. If you on the fence about getting this kit, don't be. Get you one. Get you one. And you will not be disappointed at all. Get you one. I just love the fact that this got that brace on here, man. That brace and that thumb rest. Oh, man. And like you say, man, this, this is the proper way to rock this thing, man. You can throw the mags in this joint. Throw the mags in there. Rock it like that. Like I said, these are for the range. These are for the range. Range only. I mean, um... I have I have these magazines for um, for my nine millimeter that you hollows just fine, but this particular magazine maybe because it says it's competition that it does not shoot my hollows, and I wasn't thinking about that when I bought it. I was thinking the other way. Competition they shoot anything? No, they shoot stuff for a competition. Ain't nobody gonna be at no competition shooting hollows. But I wasn't thinking that then. But it is what it is. It's good. I'd rather take it to the range, have enough capacity to shoot at the range, but that's all they're good for, in my opinion. But yeah, man. MCK kit. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm your boy, Barber State Strap, and I'm out.